What is up you guys, my name is Jared Fowler and you're watching Next Generation. My video for this week is going to be about what to do when going to Playlist Live. Seeing as how I've never been to Playlist Live before, most of this is just speculation, but I do have sort of an idea what Playlist Live is going to be about. So this list should be accurate and like fine and everything, but this is what I'm going to be doing and what I suggest you guys do if you're going to Playlist Live. So first on my list is to show up early, and this is because if you don't show up early, I'm guessing that it's going to be like feel really crowded and really like high fast paced and, and like overwhelming, but if you show up early, you're going to be like getting accustomed to the environment and you're also going to be able to register and get all your shit early before the crowds show up. Uh, so you can avoid all this trouble and all of the stress that comes with like a big large crowd and an active environment by showing up early and just get rolling on the whole playlist live experience for this year. Next on my list is to bring some money. There's going to be so many booths and things and places to buy shit at. You're going to want some money. You're going to if you don't bring money, you're going to regret it. I know this for a fact. That being said, keep it safe. I don't know. Just. Try not to get it stolen because that's sort of bad. Next on my list is bring some shit for people to sign. You're gonna be seeing a lot of your favorite YouTubers and I swear to God, for me, I need to get something for them to sign. I have a few ideas for stuff I want, you know, people to sign and, and all that, but I'm not quite sure yet, like what I'm gonna be getting, but I do know that it's gonna be awesome and it's going to be one hell of a memory when it's all finished so that's what i suggest you should definitely bring something for people to sign when you go and see them at meet and greets or whatever you're just passing them at the event you just happen to come across someone who's fucking super famous and you want to get their signature so next is to stalk your favorite content creators on all their social media so that's like twitter snapchat instagram anything you're going to want to know their locations they're going to be tweeting it out all the time you're going to be knowing what they're doing where they're going where they will be later on in the day and that's definitely what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be tweeting my locations and, and talking about what I'm doing, what I'm going to be doing for the day while I'm there. If I'm going to be doing it, you're definitely going to want to be doing it and following all of your favorites uh, YouTubers on their social media. Next on my list is bring even more money. You're going to want to get food and drinks while you're there and I've heard that it's hella expensive. So you're going to want to bring like I don't know, a few hundred bucks just to be safe, like have that safety net of like extra money hanging, you know? All I know for me is like, I'm gonna get like super hungry and super thirsty and like at the end of the day, I'm gonna be really, really tired. So I know that I'm gonna be needing a lot of food while I'm there and I don't wanna go broke, but I also wanna be able to feed myself. So I suggest you do the same. Next on my list is to bring some friends with you or find some friends who are already going. Playlist Live is a community event and if you don't have anyone to share it with, it's gonna be hella hard for you to enjoy your time. Spending time with other people is like super important when it comes to big events. Like you wouldn't go on vacation alone. I mean, some people would, but most people wouldn't. So I suggest you bring some friends along to Playlist Live or meet some that you know are already gonna be going. Plan some meetups with them, plan some stuff that you're gonna be doing. But all in all, you should definitely bring some friends and hang out with them. The last thing on my list is to bring a backpack full of essentials. And I mean, I'm talking everything you're gonna need for Playlist Live, whether that's camera gear, or chargers or shit for people to sign. You can put it in your bag as well and a couple of other things, but you're definitely gonna want to bring a bag with you to carry everything. Hey, let's say if you're going to go and buy some stuff from some of the booths, you're definitely gonna want a place to put that stuff. If you wanna see what's inside my bag for Playlist Live this year, don't forget to click the link in the description to bring you over to the video that I posted on my main channel about what's in my Playlist Live bag. That's what this is. So now I wanna know what you guys do to prepare for Playlist Live. So answer that question in the comments below. Do not forget to subscribe to Next Generation for a new video six days a week, and I'll see you all again next week. Peace.